Hi there and welcome to Quentin Carbs and Nature of Flowers. This is my 100th video that I have made. I would like to show you how I've made this really cool title sequence. To do that we need to be in Photopea. I'll talk you through it step by step. So first of all we need to go onto the internet. Here's my channel and we need to type in Photopea. Once we've opened Photopea, we need to open our picture. File open, photo library, and there is the picture. On the picture, you can see I've already typed in the words 100 videos. I will show you how to make it into this cool effect. So first of all, I need to go on the move tool, move the writing just slightly up from the horizon. I then need to go to edit, transform, and scale. I need to make the writing twice as tall so it's nice and thin. And type in 200. There's my nice tool writing. I need to move it up into the sky slightly. And then I want to add that really cool 3D effect to the writing. So to do that, I go to the layer menu, I go to the effects menu, and I go to bevel and emboss. This can be a bit laggy on my phone, so bear with me. We make it a little bit deeper on the depth, make it a little bit bigger on the size, and soften it off slightly at the bottom. Once we've done this, we go across and click OK. It will now have a really cool beveled effect. So it looks three dimensional. To add the reflection of this, the first thing I need to do is go to my layer menu, rasterize that layer so that I can then edit it. So I go to my layer menu, rasterize. And then I need to go to my layer menu and duplicate that layer. Once I've done that, I go to the move tool and I move that layer down. I also need to make it slightly less tall so that it looks more 3D. So I go to transform, I go to scale and I go for 80% high. Click done. Then it fits this perfectly into the space. Then I need to go to edit, transform, flip vertically. It's now upside down. I've got two more little tricks I need to do to it. Go to layer, change the opacity to about 50%. And then one last trick is go to the layer mode and put it on multiply done. And there you have it. There is my 100th video floating in the sky over the sea celebrating my 100th video. I hope you've enjoyed watching it. Obviously, if you have, make sure you hit that subscribe button and give it a thumbs up. Thank you very much for your continued support over my YouTube journey and have a lovely day. Goodbye.